everyone, it's Misty here. Thank you so much for joining me today. So in today's video, I have my February update for Bingo, which is a Fantastic Ladies Club, um, excuse me, created by Gaina, almost a celebrated by Gaina brain. And um, before we get into that, I just want to let you know, I am bulk filming today. So you're going to see this for the next three or four videos. Um, I had my RA infusion this past Wednesday. I'm filming this on Friday. Next week, I was going to have my um, other infusion on Thursday, Friday, but he had to move it to Monday, Tuesday. So my filming schedule is <laughs> not quite what I thought it was going to be. So I'm trying to get some filming done today and tomorrow. And so yeah, you're going to see the same outfit for a few times. But I actually like how this look turned out. So I don't mind it. I hope you don't either. <laughs> so today we are updating Bingo. So again, this is created by Kina for the Fantastic Ladies. You do not have to be in the Facebook group to join. I will have her introduction video um, linked in the description box down below along with the sign up sheet and the master list of participants. This is, we're playing bingo. Like, just like you would play regular bingo, she created five bingo cards. It's not too late to join this because she's only called, where did I put them? I think she's only called 30 of 75 numbers. So we still have, <laughs> we still have probably a long time to go. Don't make me mad today. Eight months, eight months to go is what I think it is. So yeah, yeah, and we're gonna update it. So I chose card number five out of the five that she had chosen, and I'm gonna put that on the screen. If they are X'd out, that means it was a number that was called in a product that I finished. If the um, emoji is opaque, not transparent, that means it's something I've finished, but the number hasn't been called yet. And if it's transparent, that means it's something that I'm currently working on. So the only number I got this week was three. <laughs> it's like, what did I get this week? So I'm gonna walk you through what I had, what I finished, what's rolling out, what's coming in. And yeah, I'm being very strategic because this is like last time I didn't get any numbers and this time I only got one number. Maybe I only got, I don't remember. Anyway, something like that. <laughs> I will have my playlist linked on the end slate if you're interested. So uh, let's start with I-23, and that was something fiery, so red, yellow, orange, and I brought in this. This is the Paradise Set from BH Cosmetics. It is a setting spray. You can see where we were and where we are now. I use this every time I do my makeup. It's very slow moving. Um, all of the writing is coming off this package. I mean, it's kind of sad that BH has filed bankruptcy. We don't know if they're going to be closing um, hopefully not. I enjoy their products, but yeah, so this is in for the long haul. My goal is to finish it. We ain't there yet. <laughs> so this is staying in. Well, I have a lot of BH in this project actually. Okay. For N35, it was something candy or candy related. And I brought in this. This is the vanilla cream truffle palette by BH. And my goal was to wear off the pattern of this blush. And I showed it. Ah, sure did. I really actually like this blush formula. Um, this may be a palette that I pan at some point in the future, but I'll give you swatchy swatch. It was already kind of peachy, peachy, peachy. Really pretty, looked really pretty on the face. So yeah, this can go back into my collection because it is a goal net. G57 was something metallic and I brought in this. This is the Shop Miss A Velour Highlighter. I don't know the color. My goal was to hit pan and I sure did. Can you see that? Hopefully you can see that. I can't see anything from here. I haven't had my glasses on in about five hours. I'm basically flying blind. <laughs> so I really like this highlighter. It reminds me a whole lot of the Super Shock. Um, it's just a bit more creamy. So, um, this won't be the last time you see this. I'll probably continue to work on it. That way it just doesn't dry out. But this is done for this project. Next was G52. And this palette has been sitting here. And I'm like, what did, what, what project is this in? What did I do with it? And it's this. I even grabbed it. <laughs> this is the Violet Voss Flamingo palette. And I brought this in for G52, which is animal. And my goal is to use each shade one time. I haven't used it at all because I completely forgot what was in here. So this is the color 
color scheme. It's very bright and colorful. Um, again, my goal is to use each shade one time. I don't know that that will happen by the next update, but it will happen very soon. This is a number that hasn't been called, so it's just something I'm working on to be strategic. And since this will probably take me a few months, it's probably a good idea to move this in. And I'm going to put it where the rest of my palettes go, so I remember. <laughs> G59 was something with cute packaging and I brought in this. This is my Laneige um, sleeping mask. I will pop up a screenshot of what it looked like the last time. I am just about done. I don't even know if you're going to be able to see it down there. This will definitely be done by the next update. It takes, I mean, I'll show you. I get like, whoop, like that, that much. That's it. <laughs> That's all you need. I've probably been working on this for months and months and months. I really do like this formula and I know a lot of people are like, it's so expensive, but I mean, this is an $8, I think this is the $8 size. I've been working on it for six months. I wear it every single night, so it's more than worth it. And I really do like the formula. This isn't my favorite flavor. I like the original. Um, I haven't tried the gummy bear worm one or whatever. But yeah, so my goal is to finish this and this should be done next update. But this is, I believe this is also a number that hasn't been called. The one that did get called <laughs> this week is 063 and that's something with bulky packaging and I'm bringing in this. This is the Tree Hut Charcoal Black Sugar Scrub. Um, my goal is to finish this. I'm currently working on one in Beauty A to Z. You'll see that Tuesday, I think is when that video goes live. So as soon as that one's done, this one will move in. I don't know that I'll be finished by the next update, but I will have at least started it by the next update. So this is the only number that I got this week. 063, bulky packaging. <laughs> so to be strategic across the top, I'm bringing in, B is it across the top? Top and diagonally, I don't remember. And I'm bringing in B14 and that's gonna be this. This is the BH Cosmetics Highlighter Palette. Um, I really, really love it. I've talked talked this palette up a whole, whole bunch. I love this palette. My goal is gonna be to use it 10 times. It's just, it's just so pretty. It's just so pretty. It's just so pretty. You can see just how pretty it is. And they blend out just oh they're just so beautiful they're just so pretty so yeah my goal for that again is 10 dimes and then the last thing i'm bringing in is n39 and the prompt for that is ancient culture and this i really struggled with this one because i was like okay there's the mayans and the incas <laughs> the vikings and so I went ahead and brought in this. This is the Court of Miracles blush by ColourPop and it's for the Hunchback of Notre Dame. And um, I believe she's a gypsy, I think. Um, and that is, it's not a, like, it's not a culture that's gone away, but that's to me, ancient times. <laughs> so it fit, that's the only thing I, way I can make it fit in my brain, so that's what we're doing. So this is a beautiful blush. It's really, really pretty. My goal is gonna be another 10 goal use. Um, that's it, blend it out. It's it's just so pretty. But um, maybe this will move into color pan after this, this update, I'm not sure, but that's it. So to recap, <laughs> we've got this continuing. We've got this continuing. We're bringing in a scrub, we're bringing in a blush for 10 uses, and we're bringing in a highlighter palette for 10 uses, and that's it. <laughs> Thank you so much for joining me today. Again, I will have all the information linked in the description box down below. You still have plenty of time to join this. Um, again, there are five bingo cards, and we're playing it just like bingo, and she has 75 prompts. It's really, really fun. Um, and yeah, I'm really enjoying it. So thank you so much for joining me. I love you faces. If you haven't already, please remember to hit the subscribe button. Stick around. Love to have you. Again, I'm bulk filming, so I apologize that you're going to see this look probably seven or eight times, but I got to do what I got to do. So anyways, guys, I love you. I will talk to you later. Bye for now.